so today we have latest release of citron emulator over here and that is what i'm currently running over now so um as you can see this is the latest version of the emulator and i will be guiding you on how to download and set up the latest version of this emulator on your mobile without running into any errors so without much ado let's get started Um, right now citron is one of the greatest emulators out there giving us consistent updates like we've never seen before especially after yuzu got terminated by nintendo this makes citron a top choice for anyone looking to enjoy smooth nintendo switch games right on your mobile so um what we are going to do right now is um so what we are going to do right now is we are going to go over to the official guitar page and download the emulator after that we will come back and then mention one or two things that you are going to need before you start running the app on your mobile so first of all head over to the official guitar page which is this one and then here scroll down until you see the asset section i mean under the asset section you should see something like app mainline and this is the latest release right now which is two hours ago so what you have to do is first of all you are going to download the emulator so press on this apk and then start downloading the emulator i've already downloaded the emulator so there won't be any need for me to download it again now after getting the emulator which is the apk you should see something like app mainline and then um please note before you start playing any switch games on your mobile or on your mobile or device there are some two things that you are going to need one you you will be needing a firmware and a product keys so when you look here i have my firmware over here and then also i have something called a p keys which is the product keys and sorry to say this i can't teach you where to get these two files so with that one you have to find a solution on your own so after getting both the firmware and the product keys first of all make sure that the firmware version correspond to the product keys version so um, for example i have firmware version 20.5.0 and i'll make sure that my my product keys also have the same version number as the firmware so after getting all these these files um first we have to do is we have to extract the product keys i mean before we install our emulator i mean the apk first we have to extract our product keys which is the p keys so you press on it and then you start you select on extract to achieve name so here we've successfully extracted the product keys so now we can go ahead and install our emulator apk so you just press on it and then select on install which is this one so after the installation so after you've done installing it just press on open and then you you, sh you should greet you with a welcome so when you look here it says get started just press on get started notification press on grant notification press allow and then uh, and here it says keys so now press on select keys and then select the folder that contains your product keys so um before that we extracted our product keys inside um this so this is the p keys so inside the folder that contains your product keys select your product keys and then here games press on add games select the folder that contains your nintendo switch games files or your nintendo switch games roms so my games are located inside this folder called roms so i'll press it and then inside the folder i'll press on use this use this folder which is the blue thing over here and then press on allow here i'll take in deep scan press on ok and then press on continue so um reaching this this stage means you you follow the guy successful and then you should see your games at the home page now um this session is for the snapdragon users or the snap snapdragon devices so if you are if you have a snapdragon device and you have your custom gpu drivers 
you may you know um, use it alongside with this emulator to give you much or more performance in your games so to install your custom gpu drivers go to the settings like this select on gpu driver manager which is this one and then at the down right corner over here you should see something like install so press on it and then select the folder that contains your custom gpu drivers so this is the latest version of my driver so i'm going ahead and then select it so i'll just select it and then it should install the drivers so um one thing one thing one thing i like about citron is they've added some extra features that i really like so when you look here when you go advanced session and then under the graphics session you should see something like fsr 2.0 quality mode so what this simply means is that um under which one you select is going to have an impact on your games so under quality means you are going to have more quality and balance means when you set it on balance it means you are going to have um 50 50 which is going to be 50 percent of quality and then 50 percent of performance when you select performance you are going to have performance great performance and then when you select on ultra performance it means you are going to severely have more performance on your games so um i don't think about this so i'll just select on quality because me i want more quality so um this is this is how we download and install the latest version of the citron emulator on our android device so if you really like this video please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and also give me a like on this video see you next time